Hello everybody, I am Brandman19 and welcome to part 9 of our Ottoman Empire Reborn campaign in Supreme Ruler Ultimate. Right now we are trying to get our economy back on track after having a long and very... It wasn't a difficult war, but it definitely was not a war that I wanted to fight against Russia up here. Uh, we did end up choosing just to annex them. Makes much more sense to annex them. So, uh... That's what we did. Let's see here. Um, kinds of cool stuff going on. Yeah, region falls. It's fine. All right. Looks like uh, the Ukraine is popping up little partisans in places, so they're giving France a hard time. We are kind of hoping that our economy can turn it around here. I don't know what is actually causing the problem. Let's see, we are taxing at 52.4%, unemployment's down to 9.1%. What are we spending our money on? Construction has 340 million wrapped up in it. And we're just up and down. Research is at like 150, yeah, 100, yeah about 160 million, we'll just say there. Defense is at, about, yeah, 400, 500 million right now, so it's up and down too. Production's just so high, I have no clue how to limit production. It might be something to do with uh, techs, but we are kind of a long way off from getting into any good kind of uh, factory techs and stuff like that. Why are you gathering right here? If you plan to attack us, I'm going to be so mad. And I will fight you, I'll cut all of your men off, and then you will have nothing you can do about it. Just to go ahead, because I'm pretty sure that's what they want to do. Okay, units react, and let's see what high does. High puts um, attack and defend. Let's just go medium on everything. I want to be prepared for war, if needed. I don't want to have to fight, but I will be prepared if I need to do it. Uh, industrial goods, that's no good for me. There's an airbase completed, it must be one of those ones we were attacking. I don't know where, because I got rid of the message. It's seven, eight, okay, there we go, might be going back up. We're going to put everything on fastest. We just captured a spy from Romania. Okay, get rid of that. It's either from Romania, which is blue, yellow, red, or it's from Chad. <laughs> Highly doubtful, but Chad's also blue, yellow, red, and it's really the exact same flag. There might be a tiny difference in the coloration of the blue. I think that's the uh, I think that's the main argument that those two have. see why is that highlighted is there a reason that's highlighted no not really okay uh, we're really not advancing here why not our tax rates at 51% what are our people at again they are at let's see how pro us are they? 22.7s, so their domestic approval sucks. Social rating, I mean, I can't fix it too much, though. I mean, I could. I could go in there and slowly increase social spending, but I don't have the money to offset it. And our trades can't do that. I think they're just having to deal with... Uh, there we go. We'll get rid of them. I think they were just having to deal with the fact that they have a ton of partisans running around. They're just trying their best to stop them. What is this? This is a construction complete, I guess, on a hydro facility? I'm not sure. Let's see. I don't see anything I can really do. How large is our army? 228 units, it could be bigger. 
Most certainly it can be bigger. Uh, the Japanese is a good one. We're up to 11 billion. We are running at the fastest speed possible, so we might click through some time in months here. Unfortunately, it's not like clicking through and allowing my uh, taxes to get any better. Let's see, average interest rates at 7.1%. New debt is at 6.3. If I were to take it, credit rating is 5.6. We have 734 billion total in debt. We need to get rid of that. New Alliance, Norway and Finland. Congratulations, guys. Right, um, none of these guys down here are red, or even like a light blue, and nobody over here is. Same down here, nobody in Africa is. All right, so everybody in Africa is like, nope, we are staying neutral to everything. These guys down here are light blue together. That's good. What is your... You don't even have an economy, do you? We're going to do this because I can. They are a colony. Let's see if I can find a way to bring them in. Urge independence. Discourage independence. There we go. Uh, annex this colony. Yes, Turkish Cyprus is now ours. So now we can go in here and take out that if we want to. Because there's no Russia, and I mean, honestly, if France wasn't there and neither was Romania, then I would go ahead and grab this. Yeah, that made France mad when I did that, though. There's some things out here getting done. Maybe some hydro plants in both of them. Yep, it was a hydro plant. That's good. Our electricity is still about 100,000 behind what we need, but hey, it's getting closer. Uh, I don't want to work that deal with you, France. Okay, time's pushing four on these ships. Everything's still in place everywhere else. Looking through these ships a little bit. There's there's a few that require like other things to be done. Modern aircraft too, modern supercarriers. Naval nuclear reactors, stuff like that need to be done, but hey, there's a possibility they'll get done. Ugh, this is up and down. I don't like this. This deficit needs to go down. And I think it's production that's going up that's causing it to have a problem. Social services as well. Construction, social services, interest on the loan. Like, if I could go with no social services for a while, I would do that. Matter of fact, I bet you I could. Let's see, where's, uh... Here it is, it's over here. Okay, we went down to... Here in healthcare, down to here in education, infrastructure stays. It's healthcare you spend the most. Education as well. Family subsidies goes down. Law enforcement will keep. Everything else stays. Now watch our money just skyrocket. Let's see, where's my expense report now? Yeah, 458 million. I didn't save too much, I guess. Thought I would save more. I'm actually going down in money right now. War declared the US on Cuba. All right, Hillary, I'm going to support that move. Hillary Clinton's in control over there. 
That didn't happen in real life, obviously, but this game, when it was made, was like the assumption that Jeb Bush and Hillary Clinton were going to be the two fighting it out. There's no Donald Trump thought of, and then uh, they created a DLC called uh, Trump Rising, which it puts Trump like a... It adds some cool things to the campaign. Uh, we'll probably explore it later on at some point. But uh, the U.S. is separated into the West areas by that has Bernie. There are primarily southern states. Uh, there's a few other non-battleground states in central states that are Trumps. There's like an independent, like all the border or all the battleground states are actually owned by Ted Cruz in like an independent state. And then uh, Hillary has like a northeastern alliance going on for herself. And the whole entire point is to uh, bring... Uh, Trump's party or Trump's nation to power all throughout the United States. It's pretty unique. It's different. Let's see. Nicosia, we ain't got to deal with. Algeria's wanting to trade with us, but I don't like those deals. Let's see. France still doesn't like us. Romania doesn't like us. Moldova, Greece. Is none, of our, our, none of our neighbors like us, I'm sure. Yep, none of them like us. Well, that's just fine. Our money is still ugh, just poor. Why are we not making our money on anymore? Let's see. Uh, I mean, the only thing we're not making money on is electric power. Military goods were fine. Industrial goods might be drawing us down. Consumer goods, maybe. Let's see. Military goods could make money for us, but we're not doing it to full capacity. Hmm. How's our people doing? Yeah, 8.4% unemployment, so that's gone down. The tax rate has remained the same. Can't tell GDP. I think GDP is on the rise. Um, domestic approval has gone down, of course. Let me see here. We're going to lock social spending. And we're just going to go ahead and raise this. Recommended is 688. And we're going to we're going to have a Pretty nasty repercussion here, but 565 here. We need 252 here is a recommended. Environment 112. Maybe it's about uh, making the people ultra happy so they want to spend more money. Let's see, 326. Uh, there we go, fine. Uh, law enforcement to 129, or as close as I can to it. There it is. Uh, cultural subsidies, 112. This is not like Erdogan at all, by the way. Seven twenty-eight. It's fine. Okay, so now we're gonna lose a lot of money very quickly. But the I had hoped that we're gonna increase our taxes to cover. Daily taxation on this day was two one five four. Let's see if it goes up. Two one six five. So they're going up like ten million at a day. Hopefully they're gonna try to cover it. Yeah, overall tax went to fifty-three percent. Let's go here, uh, 7.2, that's fine. Looks like our economy, or at least our production is trying to keep up. There goes some more hydro facilities getting done. Let's take a look at how much that power is. It's at 588. All right, um, can I fix my tax? I know this is kind of boring. 
Yeah, it doesn't do much to tell us about how to fix our tax income, though, does it? Doesn't say a recommended or anything of that nature. There's a low income tax, a corporate tax. I think it's better off if I just set this all at once. Let's just set it to 70% for now. And that should uh maybe offset quite a bit. Maybe later on when all of my uh I don't have to worry about research so much. Satellite available for launch, we ain't gonna worry about that. What did he set? It's at 70%. Let's see if he ends up knocking it down over some time. We of course don't want him to do that, but he could. Our people are at 24.1% and liking us. Our last stage trades went up to, I mean, double. So that made up for that one day we messed up. Let's see if it's going to go back up. Uh, it's still going above. 400 million more. Come on, I need more than that, though. Still above. It's not much. We're not making an overall gain. That's really great. That's what I'm looking for. And that day kind of sucked. I don't know whose economy I would need to take over to really fix that, though. Yeah, then we fixed it this day. We're probably going to sit at like $7 billion for forever. Which is not what we want to do. Cuba was eliminated. The U.S. probably did a massive naval invasion. Let's uh, scroll over there and take a look. Alright, coming into view now. Look at all these units. Yeah, they have plenty of units coming down here. And they look like they invaded out of here, Guantanamo, and then just pushed their way across. Not too bad. I uh, don't like you for doing these bad, bad, bad trade deals. And I would love it if my economy actually increased. I want to pay off some loans. There's some rubber synthesizers getting done. What is my, uh... I'll do a little bit of work here and see something. Expenses. Production has gone up a little bit. Look, our construction is starting to go down. I'm not really seeing it in the deficit reports, though. Let's see here. Maybe if I had more people under my control, that might work. Um, there's 23 million. Uh, yeah, that one's not really a great idea to do. Hmm, 23 million. There's 70. If I went after Iran, I would take out a massive chunk of, you know, baddie that I, I want. You know, why don't we go ahead and start thinking about that war? One with Iran, that would add a bunch of oil. Um, it would increase probably the biggest problem I would have with the region. And then we take that, we go all the way down here, we get the oil, and then uh, call it quits. That wouldn't be a bad war. I don't know if I can run it with my uh, military in the shape that it is in my economy in the shape that it is so we'll turn this guy off of social spending now he, it's gonna have to go down it is most certainly gonna have to go down I hate it I would love to see it continue but I just can't afford to do it Albania is not doing a great deal. There goes that. War declared. Iran on Kurdistan. And for that, I mean, not like I'm really wanting to protect them. I really want to take Kurdistan for myself. They have nothing but militia. Not a whole lot of greatness going on there. 
Let's see, what else do I have? Some more unit designs getting pumped done, out and done. Let's see, these guys don't take but like 50, 70 days, 70 days, 80, 100, 110, 120. Yeah, that's not too bad. There's another hydro facility getting done. Oh, our power is now above what we need it to be. Everything is above. Yeah, you can't get much better than that, right? You can't, you can be above. Let's take a quick look at that economy one more time. Social spending. Yeah, it's going down. Like, rapidly going down. Like, it was great while it lasted. But, <laughs> we can't sustain it. So, how is our economy looking? We're down to 1791. We are at 7% unemployment, 1% inflation. 62.4 is our overall tax rate. It must have gone down. Yep, that's what's going on. People's approval went up. It's going down again, I'm sure. But all right, guys. I know this is a boring episode. I think next time I'm going to get the army prepared. We're going to go after Iran, especially once they take all of Kurdistan. And then uh, we'll try to sweep across and get most of Iran for ourselves. But all right, guys. appreciate you all so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.